Barry Griffith joined now by head coach Dave Davis. Newberry a winner tonight, 99-80. to 80. Coach, at least they held you under 100. However, I think you want to give credit to Southern Wesley. They shot 63% in the second half. They, they were chasing you. I thought they were uh, terrific. I thought they uh, uh, played their hearts out tonight. Uh, I thought we gave them many reasons uh, tonight to give up, but they didn't. There was a lot of fight in those kids, and... Uh, and they came back and what cut it eight or seven, uh, and uh, and definitely had a chance to win the game. And uh, we, you know, we we, we understand uh, every game is a chance to win and lose. And uh, and tonight was no different. We got a lead early, but we didn't hold that lead. Uh, but I'll tell you, I was really proud of our guys when it got tight. I thought we really made that was probably the best basketball we played uh, from when they got uh, the score to under ten. And I uh, thought our guys uh, made plays on both ends. Dondre Walker really stepped up and made a couple of shots for us. Mark took them to the goal one time. James uh, Ashby made great plays on both ends. We won loose balls at that point uh, when we hadn't been doing that previously. So um, so it wasn't perfect. Uh, there's a lot of things we got to get better at from tonight. But uh, I'll tell you what I take away, Gary, is, is a team that makes plays when it counts. And, uh, and that out has not always been the case in my in my time at Newberry. One other thing, not only are, is your team making plays when it counts. Number one, I don't think they, quote, panic tonight yeah. at all. Yeah, And uh, great continue, point. Yeah, continued play in, uh, you know, Newberry basketball and the fact you have five players in double figures. No one is having to carry the brunt offensively. No, it's uh, it's a very balanced, uh, balanced team. I thought uh, Xavier Hill, a uh, uh, young freshman, had a really good game. Uh, for us tonight, made some big shots and uh, and got some rebounds and uh, uh, you know you you just can't concentrate on any on any one guy uh, uh, in our team and um, they're so unselfish they're not they're not concerned about their own uh, individual numbers they're they're concerned about our uh, chance to win and uh, you know I think we got frustrated a little bit uh, at times tonight but again I think that that credit uh, goes to uh, Southern Wesleyan and they came in here and uh, and really put up a great fight. As a coach is wont to do, this game already in the in the rearview mirror, so to speak, you've got to turn your attention with a very short turnaround and sure. play a very good team on Monday night Lincoln Memorial. Yeah, you know, definitely our biggest biggest test of the season. They're they're an outstanding team. The championship of this league runs uh, runs through Lincoln Memorial every single year. It will be a, a huge challenge uh, for us, especially at their place after a, you know a long uh, ride over there. Uh, but uh, but I'm I'm excited uh, that that our that we'll get that opportunity and that um, and that we'll get it right before Christmas and uh, and you know the Lincoln Memorial is a team we're going to have to beat uh, uh, on no days rest or one days rest uh, in order to win a championship at Newberry so uh, I'm excited to see how our guys react to that. When you said one day or no days rest, I thought you were going to project toward the tournament. It could come down to sure. playing a team like you know Lincoln Memorial with with no days rest That's in the tournament. Yeah, the Saturday Sunday is how it finishes up, and uh, and you you know you you're going to finish a game and then you're going to play the next day, and uh, and that's how championships are won and. Uh, you notice our schedule has has been set up like that uh, uh, many times here in first semester, hoping to to give our guys uh, at least a taste of what what that might look like if we're fortunate enough to uh, get that opportunity uh, late in the year. But uh, Brandon Taylor, you know, made made some big shots uh, uh, for us tonight. Uh, uh, Demarcus Smith was was extremely sick and and weak, but uh, but really fought and made <laughs> made big baskets for us and. Uh, you know, we weren't weren't really uh, at, at our full strength. We're we're coming off that whole final exam thing, and uh, uh, maybe possibly we were looking ahead to Monday. Uh, you know, we had beat these guys uh, um, pr pretty handily the first time we played them on the road. But uh, you know, that's how it is in in, in uh, college basketball. Every game presents uh, different challenges, and I just you know I'm really pleased that our guys uh, that our guys stepped up and, and and made their big plays. You know, right there at the end. I don't want to say, are you satisfied or pleased with this team? Because if you say yes, the nature of sports is you always have to be competitive. Sure. Having said that, however, do you like where the team is right now with the makeup of this team at this point of the season? Well, I think uh, our freshmen are playing better uh, uh, than I thought they would at this point, so that's good. I, I credit the veterans on, on really bringing them along. Uh, the fact that we truly do have 13 guys we can put in the game is uh, uh, unbelievably rare in college basketball, so I'm excited about that. Uh, but, you know, we, we've looked at uh, and dissect everything that we do, and there's tons and tons of ways for this 
for this team to get better. And uh, if we start thinking or focusing on anything other than let's get better every single day, then, then we're going to be in big trouble. Well, we just came off of Thanksgiving, heading into Christmas. I would say, I would say over the river and through the woods to Grandmother's house, but it's kind of over the mountains onto Lincoln Memorial. <laughs> <laughs> In one form, uh, I hope to see you there Monday night. You have a tough game on Monday night against Lincoln Memorial. Yep, no doubt about it. The biggest game in, in Division II uh, in the country, and uh, Newberry will be a part of that. And uh, that's certainly exciting for our program, and uh, and we've come a long way in, in a short time. And uh, th this team has a has a chance at, at greatness without question. And uh, and, and Lincoln will be an incredible, incredible challenge for us, and I'm, I'm anxious to see how we'll react to that. Head coach Dave Davis of the Newberry Wolves. They win tonight 99-80 against Southern Wesleyan. Dave, I'll see you in one, one way or another Monday night. Thank you, Gary. I'll take a 30-second break. I'll wrap it up on WKDK right after this. Yeah, I look. I thought College of Faith might be pretty good. Yes, sure did. Hey, I'll see you one way.